So we are Andy and Joe Burwell. The property is called Cobrabold and we're on the southern side of Walka. Approximately a thousand hectares, running 520 cows. Cow calf operation, selling wieners. So Andy and I have been here for just over three years. It was a blank canvas basically when we came here. It was Landcare that first advertised the, the project and Andy said, oh, this looks interesting. And you made a phone call to the Landcare representative. She enlightened you, didn't she, on what it was all about, who was involved, who the team were. Instantly, you were interested. So we've realised that the project is deep water to Walker, which is a huge area. And there have been open days, field days or whatever within that group that if we couldn't go to one, we could go to another. So that's been really valuable that there's been choices. And so we didn't miss any of the talks. The skills and techniques we're using now means we measure pasture more accurately, both of us, rather than just mm. one of us guessing. The length of the project's been really good and the fact we can go back to other people's properties and see if their management's working or not working, how their season's going compared to your season. The reason for going onto the course was to learn your pasture measurements more accurately. Talking back to the owner and when he's on the phone, he doesn't come up very often, we can actually talk about feed and say yes, this, this, or you know, we need to sell stock. That's the value we're finding. Just a bit more science behind it. So the aspects of the coaching sessions has been great to meet other people within our area and sort of strike up friendships and bash around ideas and that sort of thing. I mean, you've made some valuable contacts, haven't you, really, through meeting other people through the coaching sessions. You realise that you're all in the same boat, really. Talking to other people is good to your mental health. You don't see anybody. You know, the road, road's there, but we don't it's see lonely. to go out and actually spend time talking to other people, different farmers. And it's just, some of it's just fun, it's just a laugh, and it's just different to what you did before. And then you can get into the serious stuff you really want to, but it's just that bit of a chuckle. I think the sharing of information is probably one of the most important things. And everybody's willing to listen to everybody else. It is very much a sharing of ideas, you know, what's worked for them and what didn't work. So as far as getting together with other people in the area, it's very valuable. One of the workshops, we, we got David, the owner, who came with us, again, to see what we're all about. And through the workshop, David, the owner, is now logging into the Ag360 and he's now spoken to Jamie Lee herself and been more involved with it. And he, we can now both log in together and look at the pastures, look at the moisture, look at the full predicted rainfall, whereas this comes down to five kilometre squares, which is a lot more accurate. And certainly this season, with the variable season we've had, Ag360 has been far more accurate than anything else. And he's been very impressed with it as we have. We're able to talk on the same page, looking at the same information, which has been very useful. Yes, the Ag360 program itself is very easy to use. Um, and it's just a matter of entering your data once you get your head around which column to press. It's pretty straightforward. And then it's actually look at that particularly the future forecast and your soil moisture forecast and that side of it's really interesting. And yeah, you look at bomb maps all day long, but this actually gives you six months in advance and it's reasonably accurate. We've found up to date anyway. Long term, it will hopefully be more rotational grazing, trying to leave more pasture on the ground than previously. They're just predicting the droughts better. As previously, they sold everything in the 2019, just before it rained. Hopefully with this Ag360 rain predictions, you can sort of see there might be some rain coming. You don't necessarily have to sell everybody. So it's important that we, that we have a future. So planning ahead and knowing what's ahead secures our future here. So the opportunities that come along have been amazing through the Future Drought Funding Project. It's an opportunity. Why wouldn't you take it up? It, it, it's so valuable.